it's Maria from Still Dreaming Homestead. Glad to be back with you as always. It's a blessing. I'm waving at the people that just gave me some wood shavings. Um, super happy from a job. They like to find a place they can dump their loads and this was a great place to dump. I'll use it for a lot of things. But we've had a couple hard frosts since my last video so I thought I'd show you some changes in the garden that I have to work on. Fig tree doesn't look so good. And this one looks worse. I'm top dressing all the garden beds with leaves. And this is what my beans look like. And this is what my birdhouse gourd vine looks like. Pretty crunchy. Very crunchy. The tomato vines are doing bad. There's still some tomatoes on it. This one's not even split. Hmm. That is good. Oops. But they're wanting to fall. And my peppers are done. Celery, though, is very hardy, and I'll be harvesting the rest of it soon. Dill is also very hardy, and I'll get to harvest it also. The melons aren't going to ripen. We dug out a couple of blueberries because I want ones that will get tall. Looks like. Everything's getting a top dressing. I don't know if this is done or not. Strawberries really do still look beautiful. Marigolds, not as much. And the squash is done. The last little sunflowers, you can see, are still alive. And beautiful. Everything's kind of messy. That little bit of chard is doing good. The ornamental persimmon. Uh, Pomegranate, it's doing beautiful. It's really pretty this time of year. We have some nice size pomegranates, but I'm really, really not sure if they will ripen enough. The marigolds are still beautiful. Chicken is scratching around in the front yard. These are giving one more pop of color. And in here, the lavender and mums look very pretty, as well as the sage. I just top dressed everything with leaves. This almost looks like a duck. So all the leaves are done on my Fuji, Fuji persimmon and you can see these are these are really nice size and uh, there's lots of them. This is usually the last thing that I get to harvest um, other than potatoes. I'm leaving potatoes in the ground because I realize we really really have a lot in the house. Well I just wanted to give you a little garden update. It's a big change from last time. 
So it's Maria from Steel Dreaming Homestead. I want to pray blessings on you and yours in your house, out of your house, in the day and the night. And whatever you do, keep dreaming. Bye-bye. God bless you.